Greetings again, traveler. As it is not the first time that I greet you, how may I be of assistance? What do you know of Munarvagir? The smaller village to the southeast is named Munarvagir and is found south and to the east of here. It is smaller than Fonsiktuna and fewer people live southeast of here than in this city. Munarvagir is ruled by the Jarl Ilfe, although the people who live in Munarvagir, east and south of here, sometimes think that the Jarl, who is called Ilfing, should not have a say in their village. What can I find in Yarnvadir? Since Bonsiktuna lies within a forest, the city is surrounded by a forest. You cannot usually see this forest because there are trees that get in the way of your view of the forest. The forest is known as Yarnvadir, or the Iron Wood. This name is a contradiction, since wood is not made of iron, which it contradicts. But perhaps whoever named this forest simply likes to play golf in the forest. If you would know details of the forest called Yarnvidir, which is the forest in which Fonsiktuna is located, then please ask me details about this forest. What do you know about trolls? Most well known of the trolls is Thrivoldi who is a two-headed troll who roams the forest with his two heads. It is said that one head is named Thri, and the other of his two heads is named Valdi. Although this would lead to a quarrel between the two heads of the troll regarding which head should claim which part of the name Trivaldi. It is said that Trivaldi is in the service of Egtha, a frost giant who is the master of the two-headed troll. Do you know of the blue icy flowers? These dangerous flowers are alchemical components, which I sometimes use for alchemical purposes, but they are dangerous to use as components. You should not touch the flowers. While you avoid touching them, certainly avoid stepping into the flower bed, because you would be touching them with your legs. The alchemical flowers are deadly to touch, which is why they are dangerous. Do not touch them unless you want to touch a deadly flower. Are there many foxes in the forest? The common fox, also known as Volpes Lagopus, comes in several colors. Although you will not be able to see a white fox, because this fox is as white as the snow it stands in. The fox is prized among alchemists for its fur, which is an alchemical component to be used in alchemy. Since I am an alchemist, I would be happy if you could bring me some fox fur. Do 
Do you know Ratatosk the Squirrel? The Doom Squirrel is the evil squirrel of doom, which will doom us all through the evil that he has squirreled away, leading us to an evil doom. Do not underestimate this foul beast, because if your estimation is under his foulness, then the beast will have been underestimated when it unleashes its doom most foul. Also, its teeth are sharp. You had best stay away from its sharp teeth of doom that you should also not underestimate. I would like to learn about Spartalfheim. Spartalfheim is a mystical realm. Being a mystic myself, I'm well versed in the mystique of this mystical realm, as well as its mysteries. What creatures live in Spartalfheim? Within Svartalfheim live the Svartalfheim, and since Svartalfheim is named after them, it is therefore named the realm of the Svartalfheim, or Svartalfheim. They are powerful enchanters and masters of illusion, using their enchanting illusions to be a true master of their power. They may even teach you a masterful enchantment if you overpower them in combat. It is said they live a long time, often living several hundreds of years, which is said to be a long time. Because of their illusion, it is hard to be certain of this. In fact, you may even have spoken to a Svartalf without having realized that it was a Svartalf that you had spoken to. Perhaps even I could be a Svartalf without telling you that you are talking to a Svartalf. How can I get to Svartalfheim? I am a sage, studying sagacious subjects from the safety of my study. Since it would not be safe to travel to Svartalfheim, I'm not interested in traveling there. And so, not study the ways of doing so. I wish you... It is time that I return to my duties. I cannot speak now. My son has disappeared. Orvindel tells me that Jaime is in Svartalfheim. I will go there and look for him. Thank you so much. We eagerly await your return. Poor Hervor is really upset that Jaime has disappeared. I hope the boy is found soon. He went into the forest one night and has not returned. We fear there may be evil trolls at work. I would like to learn about Svartalfheim. Well, so would I. Sorry, but I cannot help you there. I wish you good health. Be careful out there.
a harsh winter we haven't, and there'll be little food left. So. Here is a coin. Thank you. Tell me who you are. Your name's Crocker. I'd be an orphan here in the Novagare. I'd be out in Lombardy finding herbs and toadstools, if not for this ugly winter. So I help out local folks and depend upon their charity and hospitality. Haven't starved yet. How is the village doing? Welcome to all fair city, my lady. We get a fair bit more travelers in summer. I'm sailors from Gonvik, too. Now she's isolate with all the snow, but we still be cozy in here. Wait for spring. Are there villages ye would know about? Would you tell me about Sigrun? Sigrun is a kind lady who keeps a shop near the gates. You should be kind to her, too. She just lost her husband in battle, and it's still morning. What does Lyft do? Well, he healed us when we be getting sick. Most of the warriors here have been badly hurt sometimes, and without Liffy, he'll be dead by now. Steps are good, of course. He be good enough that he needs no either. Tell me about Sigurd. Sigurd be the boss in another gear. Mighty warrior he for countless battles against the trolls, and all the folks listen to him when there's trouble. He keeps us in northern town. You should go visit. Can we speak about Reagan? Reagan used to be traveling too. I would be glad to meet a traveler such as you. He collects items from far away. Tis all junk if you ask me. Maybe we pay you for some outlandish goods. You can all find him in the library at night. Or at Sigurd's Inn, of course. What about the town librarian? He has this big place with shelves and shelves of books and more books. Alas, I cannot read for myself. But he'd be happy to show ye. Oh, and he has this cat who's cute. And this ghost thing who is not so cute. What can you tell me about the big city? It lies northwest of here, through the forest. It is bigger than our hometown, but the people are unkind. I just like going there. Let us speak of the woodlands. You cannot miss them. Just step out our gate. Trees as far as the eye can see. It is dangerous in winter. With them trolls and wolves out, I would not travel alone. But you do look as dangerous as a troll to me, if you don't mind my saying. So you're probably safe, if you keep an eye out. I would advise that you stay with the Manavagir during nighttime. The forest is much safer by day. Have you heard of Svartalfheim? Svartalfheim is a hazardous realm that no human can enter and live. But we have heard many old tales from that. Tis told that the great wolf Fenrir, sure the Loki, lies found in the deepest reaches of Svartalfheim. I think I have heard of him. It is a little rat who is the companion of the wizard of Spielberg. Don't be daft. Fenrir, the Erwolf. Brother of Hell and Jormungand, tis a huge, feral creature of destruction, not some little rat. And an author that has foretold that Fenrir would cause great harm to the Aesir, and so they sought to bind him. They tossed the Svotlfar to forge the great Fenagleifnir, and tricked Fenrir to fix it round his neck and prove his strength by breaking it. But the great wolf was weary, and would not accept the fetter till Odin's son Tyr placed his hand in Fenrir's mouth. The fetter held, and thus Fenrir will be bound till Ragnarok comes. And thus did Tyr, the god of battle, lose his right hand. What do you think about the Jarl? <laughs> the I am mighty Jarl think he's running all town. He is wrong with that. He lives far away in a big castle and cares not for us common folk. Spit on him, I would. Why did you steal from me? 
is not personal, lady. I need food to get me through the harsh winter. And you look like you and Manny to spare. That's all. <laughs> what else ought to do? Look all pretty and over rich man takes pity and marries me. <laughs> I'd rather keep me baked in my own hat, thank you kindly. What happened to your parents? My mum died when I was born. And my father got eaten by a troll. It was a long time ago. I'd sooner not speak of it. Let us... It was a pleasure to... Good day to you. I hope your travels keep you safe, but if not, I may be able to help you. I would like to learn about Svartalfheim. Svartalfheim? No, I cannot help you there. I like it here at Midgard, so I have never paid much attention to tales about the other worlds. I would like to- There is value in potions and alchemy. Odin of the Shaggy Cloak knows this and was willing to put out one of his own eyes for- I am happy to tell you that my prices are not so steep. Although I do not sell the wisdom water, there likely is none of it left in this world. Perhaps you are interested in purchasing- Do you need- I am always in need of ingredients. Particularly any- In particular, I have run out of willow bark. There is a special bark that glows in the dark, and thus can be only harvested- I would like it. It is always wise to keep a few healing potions that they are guaranteed to save you from certain death. I wish you stay on Abigail's lot. Good day, traveler. What would you speak of? Have you heard of Svartalfheim? I concern myself with this one, not the others. I wish you good health. Travel safely. Yes, I am listening. When you have reached my age, you are... Do you have a book about Svartalfheim? 
Well, it is presently loaned out, I think. I'm sure I have the card in my filing system somewhere, but I do remember this. There is a gate to Savartelheim somewhere. If you seek to open it, you must always walk clockwise. Do not walk counterclockwise, for it will undo your work. Do you understand me? No walking Widdishins. <laughs> nice word, is it not? Widdishins. I like it a lot. Good day to you. Oh, it is very much so. Welcome back, traveler. I'm sure your stay here will be a pleasant one, even when the winter... I would like to learn about Svartalfheim. Yes, I am familiar with Svartalfheim. Is there anything you wish to know about it? How can I get to Svartalfheim? I can tell you this. You must start by touching the third stone, followed by the sixth. Then press the first, fourth, and fifth. You finish by putting your palm against the second. What? Precisely. Remember it. How can I get to Svartalfheim? I can tell you this. You must start by touching the third stone, followed by the sixth. Then press the first, fourth, and fifth. You finish by putting your palm against the second. What? Precisely. Remember it. I wish you good health. Happy adventure. Good day, Trapper. Do you have a meal for me? I do. For today, I have prepared stew of them. As we agreed, you shall have my hospitality. I wish you good health. Travel safely.
Good day, miss. Tis a harsh winter we have having. I may be a little... I think not. Well, then what do you want? I bid you fair. Don't freeze yourself.
Come forward. Behold this ancient gateway. Crafted by Vafturdnir. Guarded by the Norns. Portal to the Nine Realms. Speak your name if you would cross. I am a proud warrior who fears no troll. You may be permitted to cross. You shall be lost without a goal. If you have a destination, name it. Svartalfheim. Your destination is broad. The worlds you wander are wide. Tell us what you seek there. Heim. Is your goal truth or dream? Are you focused or merely aimless? Who told you to seek your goal out there? Hervor. Very well. You have spoken. And we have listened. You are seeking, but know not where. You are questing, but know not for what. You are lost in the void.
crack up or speak. I am a... You may be permitted to... You shall be lost without a goal. If you have a destiny... Spartalfy, your destination is the world you want. Tell us what Hi. is your goal. Are you focused? Who told you to seek your goal out there? Orvendal. Very well. You have sp and we you may pass where few mortal you shall enter where few mortal step forth into swartal time Master Hector we return to report I hear you, Favaldi. So report. We fought your big man. He was strong for a human. And fun. He insulted us! And then we smashed him into the ground. No! Oh, yes! But he did not have the eye. No eye? Are you certain? Uh, he has two normal eyes. We thought about taking those with us. But we already have four normal eyes, so we did not. Enough about your eyes. Go on. We found a small man. He was weak for a human and not fun. He did not even insult us. And then we carried him to Svartalheim. As was your plan, master. And? And what? And what about the second eye? You said enough about eyes, master. So we did not report that part. Tell me of the eye of Theosi. No! Huh? Yes, master. Immediately, master. We sent a message to the humans in the Stone City. We told them to trade the little man for the eye. They did not respond yet. Good. Any news of the hero girl? No, Master. We have not seen her. But she cannot be dangerous to us. She is only a human, after all. Do not underestimate her. As you say, Master. Here are your orders. See if there is a response from Fort Sigtuna and prepare the trolls for an assault on Munavagir. Yes, Master. Certainly, Master. <laughs> 